asked me, uh, she, she was driving this vehicle. Okay. Which way was she going? She, she was telling me she was going westbound. But Do you have any witness? Uh, I got the other driver that's involved. So he's saying, he's saying like they, they drove that she was going eastbound and he was going westbound. So they should be kind of like side striking or block the direction from the car to the car. And she didn't think it was really like, you know, like when she started talking to her. So they, she's saying like she's fine and everything. Like the Empire and everybody arrived down. She was already okay. sitting down. Who's talked to her last Who talked to her already? I did. So she, she, she did say she was the she operating she was coming from? She, she didn't tell me where she was coming from. She on the way. Yeah. So she basically says she was going westbound, but everybody else is in. I mean, the, the other guys. Do we have any C4? Huh? Do we have any C4? Uh, we don't have, we have C4, but they don't get this far. Uh, uh, state police, ca uh, capital, capital police, they, they might have something better. Yeah. Did we already get the information for that? Yeah. Ah, this jacket's the one she was talking about. This one? Ma'am? This one better? What's the phone number we can put in the computer for you? It's a plus mark. Alright. So, what happened? I, I don't Greeley. know. I'm Officer Greeley, by the way. What's that? I'm Officer Greeley, by the way. Hi, Officer Greeley. So, which, where, give me a rundown on what happened and how we ended up here. Um, I don't know. I was heading home. From where? I was heading home from. Do you have any phone calls in the truck? Yeah. You can check. Yeah. yeah. Where are we heading home? I was heading home from the. Which one? Um, Where did you go to dinner? Oh, so What's that? <laughs> I'm not sure what to say. So you don't know where you went to dinner? No, I went was staying home from the uh, I don't know. You, don't, I, I, you don't know which restaurant you went to? Well, I went to Was it in downtown? No, was it in it the West right, End? It was right here. What, did you go to the Parkville Market? Like how far, like right here, like further down Capitol or right here, like you just left it right down the road? Yeah. Aurora's? Yeah. What'd you have for dinner? I didn't anything good? Huh? I didn't have anything for dinner. Then where, where were you going? I'd go around that hall and then go straight back there. Alright, so you were coming this way towards the highway? Yeah. Okay. So how did we end up upside down? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Alright. Ma'am, can I come talk to her over here? Mm -hmm. One more step right there. Yeah. I'm gonna go right here. So you have some privacy. So you have some privacy? Yeah. Okay, so you could stand right here for me. What I want to do is I want to do some tests to make sure you're good to drive, okay? 
with right. that? I said I would like to do some tests to make sure you get to drive. Okay. I'm yeah. not driving. You're not driving anymore. No. You okay? Yeah. I, what I said is I want to make sure you are good to drive. Because the whole reason we're here is because your car is currently upside down on the road. Yeah. So I want to make sure you're good to drive. Yeah, I'm not driving. I understand you're not currently, okay? Yeah. Alright, so can you stand right here for me? Yeah. Right on my flashlight beam, right there. What I would like you to do is put your feet together, like yeah. that, and hands by your side, outside of your pockets, okay? Are you diabetic? No. I'm kind of disappointed by that. <laughs> I wish I was. Do you have a pen? Yeah, I did. I gave mine to Kara's mine. Is this good or So, were you wearing your seatbelt during the accident? Yes. Okay. Black out at all? No. Smack your head? No. Um, okay. Just make sure your feet, feet are together touching, okay? Just like mine? See? Yeah. You got a space? There you go. Okay. Okay. All right, so you're not diabetic? Do you wear contacts or glasses? Yeah. What I'd like you to do is look at the tip of my pen with your eyes, and your eyes only, and keep your head still, okay? Do you understand? Yes. Keep your head still. Uh, you want me to? Yeah, I would just want you to follow the tip of my pen with your eyes and your eyes only, okay? Yep. on the side of your pants, please. That's side of your pockets. Thank you. Outside your pockets. Almost done with this one. Keep your head straight, please. Next one, I want you to imagine there's a straight line right here, okay? You understand? Yeah. Right, go ahead and put your left foot on that straight line. And if you would like to do this without your, I see you got like little wedges. If you'd like to do them barefoot, you're more than welcome to. It's up to you. Okay? Go ahead and put your left foot on that line. Put your right foot in front of your left with your heel touching your toe. Nope, don't start yet. Just like I am. Um, I don't understand. Okay, go back right there. Put your left foot on the line. Put your right foot in front of your left with your heel touching your toe. And put your hands by your side. Stay in that position until I tell you to begin. Do you understand? Yeah. Okay, just like I am. When I tell you to begin, you're going to take nine heel to toe steps on that straight line. You're going to look. I'm sorry. Can you see when, when I tell you to begin, you're going to take nine heel to toe steps on that straight line. You're going to look at your feet, count your steps out loud, keep your hands by your side, and make sure your steps are heel to toe. It's going to look like this. One, two, oh. three. Okay. I did three. You're going to do nine, okay? Okay. On your ninth step, keep your front foot on the line and take a series of small steps and return with nine heel-to-toe steps on the line. One, two, three. Again, I did three. You're going to do nine. Once you start, don't stop. Make sure you look at your feet while you're walking. Count your steps out loud. Keep your hands by your side and make sure your steps are heel-to-toe. Do you understand? I think so. 
if you have any questions. Okay, you can begin. One, two, three, four, five. Continue the test. Yep. Do you remember the instructions I gave you? Yeah. You said count nine. Right? Yep. Count and then you were supposed to keep your front foot on the line and take a series of small steps with your other foot and return with nine heel to toe steps on the line. <laughs> I'm not sure any of that. Do you want to try it again? Want me to give you the instructions again? Yeah. Okay, let's come back over here for me. Right there. All right, so again, stand right here, a little to the left. So we're gonna imagine a straight line, okay. okay? Put your left foot on the line, put your right foot in front of your left with your heel touching your toe, and put your hands by your side. I uh, Just like I, I am. I can do this. Do you wanna get dry? Just like I am, and stay in this position until I tell you to begin, do you understand? Just how I am, right foot in front of your left with your heel touching your toe. Oh, no. Nope. Right foot in front of your left. One. Nope, ma'am. I haven't told you to start yet. Just look, see how I'm standing? Just like that. Left foot on the line. Right foot in front of your left with your heel touching your toe. Hands by your side and stay in that position until I tell you to begin. I don't think I can do this. Yeah. Okay. When I tell you to begin, you're going to take nine heel to toe steps on that straight line. You're gonna count your steps out loud, look at your feet, and keep your hands by your side. Hold on, let me finish instructing. It's gonna look like this, okay? Yeah. One, two, three. I did three, you're gonna do nine. Oh. On your ninth step, keep your front foot on the line and take a series of small steps and return with nine heel to toe steps on the line. One, two, three. Again, I did three, you're gonna do nine, okay? Make sure you look at your feet while you're walking, count your steps out loud, keep your hands by your side, Make sure your steps are heel to toe, and once you start, don't stop. Do you understand? Yeah, yeah, okay. You can begin. Remember the turn I instructed you to do? Remember the turn I instructed you to do? No. Are you done? <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. All right. Well, when do you guys have your department phones? Yeah. Can you get the timer? All right, go ahead and stand with your feet together, hands by your side. This is the last one. Okay. Feet together just like mine. Heels and toes touch them. Thank you. All right. Stay in that position until I tell you to begin, okay? Okay. When I tell you to begin, I want you to take a foot of your choice, doesn't matter which one. Sarge. Behind you. Well, hold on. I want you to pick a foot of your choice, doesn't matter which one. I want you to lift it approximately six inches off the ground. You're going to point your toe and keep both your legs straight, and you're going to look at that foot that you have raised and count out loud. It's going to look like this. 1,001, 1,002, 1,003, until I tell you to stop. Okay? Do you understand? Do you have any questions? Okay. You can begin. One, two. <laughs> One. One, two, three, four, five, six. What's that? Not you sure don't want to do. continue? I, d I don't know that I can do it. Huh? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay. Right. Now, can you put your hands behind your back corner? Listen, I'm going to bring you over to my car so you have a little more privacy. Okay, when are you guys going to be able to plaza it? Thank you.
Tuesday. And then we're going to walk to that black Tahoe over there on the right, okay? Do we have a female on scene? Can you grab my bag? Oh, yeah. Can you grab, grab that purse for her? Yeah. That's hers. We're going to walk this way. What's going on? I'm going to explain it to you over here when you have a lot more privacy, okay? Can we stop him at that sidewalk? Yep. I'll stand on the side, okay? You want to turn to your right? Do not let him come around the side of my car. Get on the sidewalk, now. Yes, that's what I'm trying to prevent. That's why it's having you turn a circle. Take a second. You're obstructing the roadway. Listen, we have a sobriety. You're, right now, you're being placed on the rest for operating on the other side, okay? I'm going to go over to that side, okay? Currently 748. You're being placed under the rest for operating under the influence, okay? You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be used against you in a court of law. You have the right to talk to a lawyer and have him or her present with you while you're being questioned. If you cannot afford to hire a lawyer, one will be appointed to represent you before any questioning if you wish. You can decide at any time to exercise these rights and not answer any questions or make any statements. Do you understand each of these rights as I have read them? Explain them to you. Yes. What? Yes. Okay. Having these rights in mind, do you wish to talk to me now? No. Okay. Listen, so we have a, we're currently at a checkpoint in downtown. I'm going to take you there. And while we're there, you'll get a phone call and you can have someone come pick you up, okay? Do you have anyone around here that can pick you up? Because I see you're from Brantford. My husband is on his way. Okay. When we get there, I'll get. I'll, once we get the process started, I'll let you get a phone call so you can let them know where you're going to be somewhere else, okay? And then I'm going to come over to that sign for your seat on. Whose turn is this? I don't know. I'll find out. I have to pull a separate 13 for the 36 if you have any motor vehicle charges. Yeah. I mean, I'm going to... Yeah. Um, Real quick, I'm going to throw your seat on. The guy with the camera. Turn this way, towards me. Towards me. Towards me. Yeah, I'm getting him away from him. Mike, you out here? Can I get that head back? Oh, 
have a shirt underneath that jacket. Oh, thank you. Is this the one or yours? That's yours. Oh, perfect. Thank you. Yeah. So, I'm going to go to the back. Put that on your purse. Her husband was on his way there, so I'm once we get this process started, I'm going to call so he knows to come here. down, I'm going to switch them so they're in the front, okay? You're going to what? switch the handcuffs so they're not behind your back. Alright. You can either put them in there or get a handcuff one hand to the, to the metal. I don't care. I'll do this so you don't have to sit here. So once we get this process started, I'll let you get a, your husband a phone call so you can let him know to come here instead, okay? Where is? Right in downtown by Bushnell Park. <laughs> the results of the chemical test or drug influence evaluation or your refusal to submit to either may be admissible in evidence against you in any legal proceedings. And at this point, would you like to contact an attorney? What do you think? I ask every single person. Uh, I don't have any training. Would you like to look through this phone book for an attorney's number? Sure. That's probably I wasn't kidding. It's a phone book. <laughs> I was dead serious when I said, asked if you want to look through a phone book. Would you like to look through it and try to find an attorney's number to call? I'm in trouble. So, um, can you contact um, the attorney? Do you of, have a number for um, an attorney? You know, like. I need an attorney. Yeah. What's that? Yeah. Yeah. I had an accident. Yeah. No, no one's hurt. Yes, I'm arrested. Do you think um, Andy Hallier can help? Who? Minicosi. Does he have a number you can write down so you can call them? I'm sorry. Where am I? You're at 100 Wells Street. I'm at 100 Wells Street. But does your husband have a number for an attorney you can contact? I'm detained. Bail me out. I explained that you're going to get a, a PTA. But right now, you need, you're looking for an attorney to contact. I'm looking for an attorney right now. To contact in regards to this. That's what this whole point is, to try to see if you have a number for an attorney to call right now. I need to call an attorney right now. Okay.
Does he have one for you? Ma'am? He's looking at our personal Can you put the phone up here until that point? Hmm? He's looking at our personal interview. Oh. Yeah, this is uh, just a, so you can call to get legal advice for this. Okay. 